was watching his own people party because he was the first president, but he died before before the White House was finished. This year, my aunt Kathy went to Mount Point and learned more about George Washington than I did. So here's my aunt Kathy at Mount Point. George Washington was not the original owner of this estate, that he inherited it from his older brother who inherited it from his grandfather and then their great grandfather and from there. Um, only his great grandfather was um, born in England. Um, Washington was actually born in the colonies. Okay. He was a very nice man. They say he was very generous and kind and that he felt it was rude to ask people to leave whenever they would come. That they could stay as long as they want. So the, the normal stay at his house was about uh, a week, five days to seven days. But they could stay as long as they want. And he had several rooms set up just for guest quarters. He was very generous to not only himself but to those that were housed at his house as well. Uh, Martha was also a very generous lady. I know you learn a lot about Martha during the Constitution camps. But yeah, Martha was also a very generous lady as well. I mean, the history that we've learned so far is just amazing. There's so much more to George Washington than what they teach you in the history books. It, what they taught us in the house is that when the butler would answer the door for George Washington, that he would decide at that time based on etiquette and how they were acting, which parlor they should go to. So they had several parlors that they would go to in that time. And one was for, one for family and friends. They acted as if they were family and friends. Then the butler would stick them in that. And it was just a basic parlor, nothing special. Um, but it did have a fireplace. It did have photos of family and friends. Um, then they had the parlor, which was for the special people, the high ranking people. And when they would come, they would, um, put them in that uh, parlor. So that parlor was for like Jefferson and Adams, um, anyone that was coming to see him. When George Washington passed away, Martha closed up his room and she would not enter that room again. She ended up moving to a room on the third floor instead of the second floor where they were living at. She was so um, upset by it, but he died within 36 hours. Um, they think that his throat started swelling and that's what caused him to pass away. I hope you enjoy my aunt's video.